Hi class. So today we're going to read another short story to help us with a quick review about the elements of plot. So as I read, I want you to listen and think about the elements for exposition. So main characters, setting, problem, rising action, the events along the way related to the problem, the climax, the big, oh my gosh, the big change, then the falling action and resolution. The story we're gonna read is, Ducks Don't Wear Socks. So here we go. Emily was a serious girl. One day, while she was in a serious mood, taking a serious walk, she met Duck. Duck was definitely not serious. Duck, asked Emily, what are you wearing? Socks, yelled Duck. Ducks don't wear socks, replied Emily quite seriously. Cold feet, yelled Duck, and off he went. The next day they met again. Emily was still serious. Duck was still not. No socks, laughed Duck. But, Emily pointed out quite earnestly, you're wearing a tie and ducks don't wear ties. Big meeting, yelled Duck, and off he ran, tie flapping in the wind. The day after, Emily was still a serious girl, but she almost smiled when she saw Duck again. A hat? asked Emily. I've never seen a duck wear a hat. Late for the roundup, yelled Duck, and off he galloped into the sunset. Emily almost laughed, but she bit her lip and managed to stay serious. Until the next day. By now you should have an idea about all the pieces of the exposition of this plot. You should know the characters, the setting, and the problem. Duck, Emily began to ask, all those boots, yelled Duck, fields to plow, crops to plant. Emily's lips slowly curled into a smile and she kept smiling until the next day when, Duck, exclaimed Emily, at the sight of Duck wearing underwear, yelled Duck. I have never ever seen a duck wearing underwear, Emily gasped. Pants on the line, yelled Duck. And off he sailed, not the least bit embarrassed. Emily smiled and she began to giggle. Before she went to sleep that night, Emily laughed just a little bit to herself. The next day, Emily just happened to meet Duck again. But this time, Emily, called Duck, what are you wearing? I'm a duck, laughed Emily. A duck, yelled Duck. Emily laughed so hard that she cried. Duck laughed so hard that he quacked. And off they went. So now we've read the story. What was the climax? The climax is when we see something really, really crazy, like it's the biggest, oh my gosh, I can't believe that just happened moment. Sometimes it's not even that big of a deal, but it's when the problem starts to get solved in a new way and it begins to work. The climax usually happens right before the turning point of the problem. So if the problem here was, Emily was quite serious, Doc was not, and Emily's been serious, 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 and all of a sudden she smiles. Is that the climax? After the climax, usually the character has some kind of change, and that's another hint that you've just seen the climax of the story. 
So did Emily change in any way? Did her character traits change? And then what was the falling action and resolution? Let's plot it.